The halls of the Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame in Springfield, Massachusetts, are full of memorabilia from some of the greatest players to ever lace up a pair of sneakers. All time NBA greats like Michael Jordan, Kareem Abdul, Jabbar, Magic Johnson, and Larry Bird were all obvious first ballot entrants, but there are plenty of outstanding players who have been left waiting for years for their name to be called. Buck Williams, 1981, 1998. Buck Williams ranks in the all time top 30 for several notable stat categories, including games played, minutes played, total rebounds, and shooting percentage. The power forward was arguably the best Nets player in franchise history, averaging 16 4 points and 11 9 for the eight seasons he spent there and 12 8 points and 10 rebounds per game for his entire career. His 4 526 offensive rebounds rank as the fourth most in history and most for any eligible player who isn't in the Hall of Fame. Paul Silas 1964-1980 Defensive specialists don't get enough credit when it comes time for Hall of Fame voting, unless they win six rings like Scottie Pippen, and Paul Silas is a prime example. A total beast of a defender and a rebounder during his entire career. Going back to his time at Creighton, Silas averaged 9, 4 points and 9, nine rebounds per game for his 16 seasons in the association. He was named to the coveted NBA All-Defensive Team a remarkable five times and he won three titles with the Celtics and the Supersonics. Nearly 40 years after his retirement, he's still ranked in the top 25. Mark Jackson 1987, 2004. Mark Jackson's career as a head coach ended without much fanfare, but his tenure as a player was fantastic. He ranks in the top 25 for games played, but that's not the most impressive figure of his career. As a pure point guard, Jackson is in rarefied air, with his 10, 334 career assists ranking fourth in history. In fact, he's one of only five players to ever earn at least 10, 000 assists and the only one not in the Hall of Fame. His exclusion from induction may be because he never won a championship and only made one all-star game.